Hi guys, welcome to Momentum with Vedantu. Thank you so much for being here. I guess this is going to be last class for many of you today. So welcome to your last class on Momentum with Vedantu. I hope you uh, still keep coming back here. We put up more videos other than just uh, academic videos and you will enjoy them. But since today is your last day guys, I just wanted to say it's a very short video. I just wanted to say guys all the best to you. Okay, all the best to you. Good luck everybody. I hope you guys do very well in tomorrow's exam. Okay, uh, just do your best tomorrow guys. Do not worry and do not stress out. It's only an exam. Your life will be what you make of it, it doesn't get decided about what happens tomorrow. Okay, there it's it's an important exam, I understand, but you are you are going to be stressing out too much if you give it too much importance. Okay, at the end of the day, your life will become what you make of it. It will not get decided about. Uh, it will not get decided with tomorrow's exam. Okay, so I hope everybody understands that. Next thing, guys. One very important tip from my side, do not study in the morning, okay? Tomorrow morning, you will have some time with you. Do not use it to study. Last minute revision is going to put you in a state of distress, okay? It's just going to make you more nervous. It's just going to remind you of things that you don't remember. And it's it's not going to help you in any way. It's just going to get your adrenaline high. You don't, you don't want that to happen. Just try to keep yourself calm. Try to do all the things that keep you calm and just go to the exam. Okay, just go to the exam. You can listen to a few songs. Or you can just talk to your parents. That's it. Don't do much. Okay, I suggest you do not talk to your friends. Talking to your friends is a recipe for disaster right now. They might ask you so many questions that will just uh, put you over the edge. Okay, so don't do that. Next. Yeah, no reading in the morning and no solving in the morning, guys. Very, very important. I hope you guys will follow that. I really hope you guys will follow this. Next tip, guys. Do not, in the exam, do not try to answer all the questions. JE Advanced is not an exam where you will be able to answer all the questions and you shouldn't even try to. There are going to be, there is going to be a lot of negative marking in the paper and it matters a lot here. So do not do not, do not try to answer all the questions. Just select a few questions, go through the paper, select the few questions that you want to answer and then come back and just solve those questions. Okay, it's an online exam, but you can still read the entire paper if you want to just do that. Mark the questions you want to solve and then just solve those questions. Okay, nothing more guys. Do not try to guess if you are correct or not correct okay answer only those questions where you are sure and there are going to be a few questions where there is no negative marking for example when i gave the exam integer type uh, integer type questions had no negative marking there if you want you can guess well then you should guess just just guess whatever answer that you feel is very close to correct okay try to solve it guess whatever answer you uh, think is close to correct and answer that okay otherwise always remember two is a very good number i have answered two wherever i want it okay so you can do that next there are going to be two pa two papers tomorrow guys in the break between the two papers do not discuss the first one okay in the break between 12 and 2.30 that, that you are going to be wanting to discuss the paper one with your friends. Do not do that. It is just going to make you more and more nervous about paper two. You need your mind to be fresh. Okay. It is just going to make you more anxious guys. Just forget about paper one after it is over and only focus on paper two. Only focus on paper two guys. Okay. And try not to talk to your friends. If anybody asks you how you did in your paper, how you did in your paper one, just tell them to get lost. Okay. Just walk out of there. Don't even talk to them. Do this. It's very, very important. Otherwise, you will be confused out of your mind in paper two. Just worrying still about paper one, which you can't do anything about. Okay. So don't worry about things we can which you cannot change. You can't do anything about paper one after it's over. Focus all of your attention in paper two only. Okay, all right, next. Many of you have this question, sir. I only prepared till J means level and tomorrow is J advanced. What should I do? What should I do? Well, guys, the first thing you should do is 
do not panic and just give it your best shot okay do not panic and just give it your best shot you have prepared well till now even if you have prepared well for j mains level you have still prepared very very well you can do so much better tomorrow in tomorrow's exam okay just do this go through the entire paper and there are so many questions which you will be able to solve just based on your mains level knowledge so try to do that find out pick out the question which you can solve and just solve them that will do you a lot of good okay doing that getting even uh, getting even 33% of the questions correct is going to make you it's it's going to get you a very good boost okay so just try to answer one third of the paper if you don't know anything and just answer whatever you do answer it correctly that would be good enough okay guys next when you are going to go to sleep today before going to sleep make sure all of your important documents are in a single place and ready to go okay what are the important documents that you need to take all these admit card and identity card which ha which you which has a photo of you on it a passport or pan card or driving license i don't think you guys will have that but at least a voter id card or an aadhar card there you have to have that on you okay take a ball point pen take pencil and erasers and when you are taking a watch please take simple analog watch do not take a digital watch they will make you remove that okay and when you are taking the hand sanitizer please only take small bottles 50 ml uh, which are uh, which are transparent okay otherwise they might ask you to remove that they will have hand sanitizers available in class they will bring that the examiners will have that but if you don't want to rely on that then take your own but only in small bottles okay next do not take the following things okay do not take calculators with you do not take log tables with you and do not take handbags and wallets with you guys these are not allowed these are not allowed next do not wear these things okay do not wear full sleeve clothes or clothes with big buttons there is no exact rule against it but sometimes an examiner on their own discretion might ask you to remove those okay so don't take any risk there just don't wear such clothes and do not wear jewelry okay they might ask you to remove that as well and in the middle of the exam i don't know where you will keep it so make sure you're not doing any of these and finally guys that's the end of the that's the end of the bowl that's the end of my uh, tips for tomorrow i hope you, all of you do well okay don't worry don't stress out i just it's hard not to stress out i understand but try to focus all of your attention on how it will be after the exam tomorrow when you will be free and finally everything will be over you have been preparing and you have been under stress for so long and finally all the stress will be over tomorrow guys so just focus on that part focus on how what you will eat after the exam focus on how where you will go after the exam which movie you want to watch just think about all those things have positive thoughts okay and that's it for me guys i don't have anything else to say best of luck everybody i'm sure you guys will do well you have prepared for it for so long everyone will do well don't worry just give your best okay just give your best guys okay chalo so have a nice day guys and bye bye